Well, except for the gold mine, this area is pretty well defended. And honestly, once again, I don't actually think keeping my guys on the walls is a good idea. It, maybe... Towers, yes. Walls, no. What the... What the hell? Okay. No, they were... <laughs> I, I, just, I don't know. Uh, can I rotate you? Nope. <laughs> well, I, I guess... That just is the way it is. So this area is getting attacked. The thing is, my enemies don't really attack the walls. They kind of do. But it's not... It doesn't happen often. So let's let's get a Ballista. Let's just... Uh, raid for as much as possible. And military... Do I, get, do I just start sticking stone walls down? Yeah. Because ultimately, I do want to protect this area as best as possible. I'll put another bliss up here. Building needs a worker. Which one? Oh, this sawmill apparently lost its workers. I wonder if, uh, if my guys stay unemployed for too long because we're maxed out on wood. That's probably exactly it. But speaking of, we have a lot of wood. So clearly we should start spending that like crazy. Okay. Get the ballista. Okay, so how's this doing? Well, how's my food doing? We are losing food. So I think I'm going to want to save wood, which we are getting gross amounts of. I'm going to just daisy chain out here. Get this stone. I We seem to have enough resource gain that I can pretty much wall off an area on a given daily basis, so we don't have to worry too much. One of the walls is inside out. Oh. You know what else is a problem? This builder has got a case of the stupids again. See if we can figure it out. That's annoying. Yeah, next time I play this, if if and when there's a next time, it probably won't be for a while, I will absolutely go out of my way to, uh... I, wait, do I... Do I not know... I don't own this region. <laughs> well, they got it. They got it backwards. Let's figure it out. Who cares? I don't actually own that land. Uh, it's fine. Uh, let's see. I get some houses down. Where do I get some houses down? Unfortunately, my my land is getting kind of packed. It kind of is. I I'm trying not to overcrowd things. I have no idea if it actually messes with my dudes wandering around. Oh no, those are my tav tavern keepers. Okay. That's going fine. Flip this. I think that should be enough. I can just hold them off accordingly. Up. Uh, I don't wanna. Finish these walls off? Yeah. Let's do that. You know, at the beginning of this, I was I was thinking that it was borderline impossible.
for me to uh, to actually surround my entire base and walls, and the answer is no, I just needed a stupid amount of stone miners to actually pull it off. Okay. It looks like regular walls do actually just have place like archer emplacements. Um, do I want to tear this up and get a stone wall? Sure, why not? The heck am I going to do with these resources anyway? Probably should also get a gate down. So next up, got a stupid amount of wood again. Perfect. General resources, we want to get Hunter's Hut. What are these holes? Those just, yeah, those are just miscellaneous holes in the land. Okay. Did I... I do have some lakes, so we might want to take this area next. Just get some more food. Uh, but I think first and foremost, let's grab this one. <laughs> just because it's bothering me a little bit that I... I took this region, uh, except for this one singular spot. I should probably get that. I should have waited on that gate. Yeah, it's fine. We'll be okay. Let's see. Looking at the city's layout reminds me that America is one of the rare s states where the roads were made with the intent that their primary user would be vehicles. You clearly have not been, yeah, to Boston. Boston is real bad. <laughs> I... I sincerely hope that at some point in my lifetime, Boston just says, you know what? Screw it. No more cars. We're going... This is only foot traffic. Uh, foot traffic and, and public transportation. And anybody that wants to drive... Uh, boy, how do you can drive to city limits and then come back in from there? Because I, I love this city. Like, it's a nice place to be, but... Traveling through it is... Heck. We might want to consider getting some more, uh... Some more fight boys. Let's start working on that. And, uh, let's see, I got another tavern down. Nope, it's maxed out. I'm just gonna have taverns everywhere. Beer for everybody. Yeah, like Venice. Maybe. Wasn't Boston made by England, not America? I, I, I technically sure. If you wanna, if you wanna go like full quibble, sure. Any of the original colonial, uh, colonial cities before American independence was, you know, succeeded, then yes, you absolutely could just say that yes, it's it's England's fault. Okay. There's a hole in my wall. That could be a problem. Whew. That's a lot of guys. The real answer, though, is I gotta... I gotta kill this. You guys can kill whatever. But we need my melee dudes to just mob that... That catapult, so there's nothing left. And luckily, it seems like the moon guards are a fair bit weaker than what I've got. But yeah, let's skip siege engines and just get a ridiculous army. six dudes for that. Heck, maybe we even look into knights. Nah. More swordsmen. Let's go bananas. 
Hey, they're building it now. Perfect. Capture that. Uh, let's see. Resources. We're out of wood. We are out of wood. It's fine. Looks like they're attacking me over there. All right. We will assault this pond. Why, sir? Guys. Okay, sir. It really doesn't want me to build a gate there. Oh, because they can't reach it. Fair. Let's see, but knights are on horses. Are they? I guess I should probably pay attention to that. Because that could actually be really helpful. Okay. What the hell? <laughs> They're just spewing out of a small corner. <laughs> A crack in the wall, and they're just like, Yes, we fit, therefore we move. Whew. Okay, how many more unemployed mooks do I have? Quite a lot. What's my money doing? Great. Supplies? Ah, I can get some more markets. Okay. Yeah, let's get some markets down. Because, yeah, we can definitely get one more for milk and one more for leather. And that'll give me some more money and a fair bit more happiness. Not incredible amounts, but... No reason not to. What's up with this singular market? Why is this one red? I guess it's because it's selling. I don't know. Okay. Are we still getting attacked over here? Yes. Well. I just remembered I've been training a whole bunch of dudes. Uh... Yeah, I don't think these knights... Yeah, these knights are not mounted. The, these knights, I'm pretty sure, are just walking around on foot. Okay. I bought this area. We didn't actually get the stone quarry for it, though. Okay. Well, now do we do the really silly thing? I I guess we might as well. What an expenditure. And we'll probably want to come out here at some point and increase, but that's okay. Alright, so let's go back in here, get a gate down. Preemptively also get another tavern. And then boatloads of houses. I don't know why they reset in rotation every single time. It's like it really wants them to be facing in. That said, I don't think anybody actually goes back into their houses at night. Oh, no, they do. The workers absolutely will go inside. Yeah, once, 
Once upon a time, I bothered with, uh, with decorations here, but I, I think I'm totally fine with just spamming taverns. Is this done? Yes. But we don't actually have anybody in it. Okay. Still being attacked out here. Did I change the... Okay, I did. So these are the knights. Yeah, not a single horse to be found. They're just dudes with big swords. Can you hold shift to build multiple buildings? Nope, I really wish I could. Alright, so money is good. Food is not. We want to scale that up. Oddly enough, we might want to scale it up by buying this area. Luckily, we're dropping food incredibly slowly, so it's not really going to hurt me too bad. Other bonus question. Can I have another windmill? No. Is there literally no other wheat field on this map? I don't think so. I haven't spotted any flowers. I'm sure they're there. Maybe this counts? Yes, it does. So, I guess bluish flowers also count. I was just assuming it was yellow flowers only. I haven't really been neglecting that. Alright. Well, I guess I'm going to capture this. Military. Build a gate. And resources, we want a hunter's hut. And next up, we'll gather that one. Wait, there's a rogue wolf? What? I don't see any more wolf dens. There's just one wolf just hanging out. Alright. Well, you know what? You do you. You live your best life. I'm not going to interfere with that. Okay. Wow, I've got a lot of unemployed dudes just hanging. That's maxed out. That's maxed out. This is not. We need more stone. We don't actually need more stone. Like, I, I could have far less stone and be totally fine with that. But then it wouldn't be excessive. And I'm not going to lie. I really like having excessive amounts of everything. It's unfortunately a bit of a simple game. I Just thinking about it in, in terms of, like, subsequent playthroughs, I'm not really sure if I'm terribly passionate about that sort of thing. It's a fun game, but uh, I need, like, an actual tech tree and some more variety before I want to go longer than this. Like, uh, let me go full Empire Earth here. That would really, that would really make things interesting. Okay. Get a field. Get this. Yeah, it'll probably add more as the game develops. That's my assumption. Uh, just... From the perspective of like immediate early access replayability, I'm I'm not in in eh, entirely sold. But I think it's just kind of a matter of. Okay, there they are. They're attacking over here now. Get them. Unleash the horde. Okay, good. The catapult is distracted hitting my wall. As opposed to my dudes.
like, I would really love it if they added full-on Age of Empire levels of, like, variants in technology. Uh, you know, getting cataphracts and horse archers. Well, Age of Empires slash Civilization. You know, give me some wild tech and some really interesting units to utilize here. Alternatively, give me wizards. I will take... I will take either. Alright, so we lost a couple of dudes for that. Let's go send an absolute army to kill this singular wolf. Oh, hold up. These guys just... Brain farted. Hello, brain farters. Are these more cows? More cows. I am really proud of my castle. It looks actually really nice. Okay. Is that it? Are we all good? Yeah, we're good. Where'd the wolf go? There it is. You have no idea what's coming to you, beast. Are there any other research? Yeah, there's actually a, quite a lot here. Obviously, getting a sufficient amount of wood... To grab all that might be a little much. But I think we got the population for it. You know, these taverns, taverns work if you actually put people in them. <laughs> Let's see. Are we out? Yeah, we're actually we're out. That's fine. I'm starting to lose track of where everything is. Oh, I still only have one priest. It's Well, it's doing all. Is this the normal difficulty or a harder one? I think this is the normal difficulty. Uh, let's see. Where are my people going? I guess they're just slowly generating. Either that or they were working on a building project. Both are entirely possible. Let's see. Beautiful kingdom only marred by that one door on the outside. Yeah. Oh well. Okay, so it is dawn of the final day. It's quite nice. They're attacking over here. That's annoying. Alright, army. Alright, so I could do some other things, but my, my food income is insane, my sunstone is decent, and my stone income is great. We're just going to leave this singular area closed off because who cares? And we are just going to wall the heck out of this. Personally, if I were designing this kingdom and I had that just errant door to the outside, I'd make it so nobody could, like, you walk in there and it's just nothing but, like, a pit trap. So anybody that goes that direction just gets, uh, dunked in a bad way. Okay. Well, in this case, do we go Trebs? Nah, let's go. Let's get some ballistas. Eh, I don't know. I don't know on that one. I'm a little worried that that'll end up in the wrong, pointing the wrong direction. If it does, I don't know, we'll make it work. So you generate happiness through the power of alcohol, or is it something else too? Mostly booze, but also you can, uh, you can generate happiness through the power of 
Holy shit, seriously? Is my oh my population is probably temping as builders. That's where they all are. Uh, through the power of alcohol, you can also put down decorations, but I haven't really bothered with that because... Uh, let's see. Grab a trebuchet. Oh, nope, this one did not end up in a hole. Okay. So I'm just going to squander most of my money on siege engines. Because at this point, my income is pretty absurd. Resources are fine, and we're on the final day. So what it, whatever I'm up against, like, shouldn't be too bad, I hope. We also need more houses. Can we name it the Trojan Door? That's, uh... Oh boy, that's a lot of just dudes. There we go. That'll give me some bonus happiness. Yeah, main problem is just utter lack of wood. I'll probably put a trebuchet on this one. We get another. Trebuchets for days, the superior siege engine. They will come after me, and it will go badly for them. Do we get another guy on this? No, nah, the well, yeah, the main problem is I just don't have enough wood to sustain more than I've already got. I guess my other option is archery. We get a bunch of knights. Nah, swordsmen. They're twice as tough. All I need are meat walls so the archers can just clean up. Please tell me. Okay, they're still attacking in the same general direction. I was going to be kind of upset if they went anywhere else. Okay. Get a ballista out here. A couple of ballistas. I don't necessarily know where my enemy is attacking from. I bet they're going to spawn over here and I'm going to be cranky. But it'll probably... I'll be fine. Ooh. Eh, no, I'm fine. How's this doing? Eh, it's doing. I'll put another guy there so it goes a little faster. We got the resources for it. How can these people erect walls so fast? They're made out of sun. Trebicate. Yeah, we. my income is great. So what's the difference between a wood wall and a stone wall? Holy shit, there's like no difference. So there's no real point to me replacing these. I'd consider it if I absolutely felt like I needed to, but nope, there is not really a whole lot of point to it. Okay, got another ballista. I'm gonna put it over here. And I will put the trebuchet here. 
And then I think I'm going to run out of time. Oh, church. Church has a couple of boys that need to get out here. All right. That's about as well-armed and armored as I think I'm going to get here. I think it's put me in a solid spot. I'm really proud of this. I wonder if there's a way to hide the UI. Hide interface. Yes, thank you. Is that it? Okay. Charge! <laughs> this is, uh... Is this it? Oh, there's Wolf Den over here. I think it broke. Either that or I really am spawn camping. Well, that was it. <laughs> what an ending. Excellent. We've defeated the Lunar Lords. It's a great victory, but our journey is just beginning. Righto. <laughs> well, I... Sure. Why not? We win. That is an unrealistic depiction of the castle. There's no way you would have enough wood for these walls. <laughs> I do love the idea of these, like, little micro-castles, but let me tell you, you would not be defending them in this manner, but that's okay. This is fun. Is this game still early access? Absolutely. It's going to be in early access for a while. It's a neat idea, and I, I like what I'm looking at, and I enjoy the gameplay a lot. Definitely needs work, but fun all the same. And for, like, a two-hour little experience, it felt great. I guess if I didn't have abundant resources, I probably should have maybe turned it up higher. But you know what? I don't really care that much. Here, I'm going to load up uh, Fractal for like two seconds. Just to see. What does Fractal look look like? Stonewalls lets you stack two rows of archers. Cool. Still completely pointless to me. It seems like just having my dudes out in the field is way better. Uh, if the enemies siege better, it wouldn't be a bad idea. Okay, so what is what is fractal? Fractal just seems to be random. I was assuming it would have like weird voids, but no, it's just kind of spread out. I don't know. I'll probably play this in flat mode next time, unless hills actually do something that I'll care a little bit more. Either way, fun game. But I'm going to leave it on the back burner probably until 1.0 and go back and play some other uh, similar games, you know, Kingdoms and Castles. I I know there's a couple other, like, cool kingdom builders that have come out recently that I'd like to sink my teeth into, too. So really what I should do is go back and actually play some of them. But for now, at least, let's move on.